Last class? Yes. yes. Hands and eyes. Hands and eyes. So we've been talking about multiplication for the last few days, and today we're going to start with a vocabulary review, and we're going to start with the word factor. Mirrors and words. Mirrors and words. Factors. Factors. Are the numbers we multiply. Are the numbers we multiply. To get a product. To get a product. Factors. Factors. Are the numbers we multiply. Are the numbers we multiply. To get a product. To get a product. Tell your shoulder partner what factors are. Teach. are the answers to multiplication problems. Products are the answers to multiplication problems. Tell your shoulder partner with a great big full body turn and lots of enthusiasm, what are products? Teach. down deep into your brains. Oh, I would like to know what is multiplication. Turn to your shoulder partner and tell them the question is what is multiplication? Summer, what is multiplication? Awesome job, 10 finger move. Woo! May, what is multiplication? Multiplication is putting together equal groups. Excellent job, 10 finger move for May. Woo! Great job for May, but I have some friends not listening and gesturing with this mighty group. Ah! Let's try another one. What is multiplication? George. Mul multiplication. It is is repeated addition. Very good. Ten finger room. On our next question, I want you to remember we should be starting with our class class. I hear something. Do you hear it? No. You don't hear it? Yeah, I do. I hear something. What? Biffy. Biffy is here. I think he has a challenge for us. There he is. His challenge today is, how are multiplication and addition alike? Wait, Biffy's telling me something. Uh-oh. Ready? He is telling me you all are very smart about answering it's this true. question. That you have many great ideas about how to answer this question. I would like for you to take your Biffy and your Smarty cards, turn to your shoulder partner, and have a conversation about how addition and multiplication okay. are alike. They both make the number increase. Very good. Ten finger move for them. Woo! Tayanche, do you have an answer for how multiplication and addition are on? Kim's going to play Biffy and Tayanche is going to play Smarty. How are multiplication and addition alike? The multiplication and addition are alike. 
Because clappers. David, do you have an idea about how multiplication and addition are of one? Well, multiplication and addition are alike because they both can use the flip flop property. Okay. We made this connection about how adding and subtracting use the flip flop property. Good, David, 10 finger woo. Woo! May. You reminded us earlier that that flip-flop property has a special name. Can you remind us again what that special name is? The other name for the flip-flop property is the commutative property. Excellent job using a complete sentence. Give her a five finger. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Biffy says he has another challenge. Uh -huh. hmm. Let's see what his other challenge is. Here he is. Here I am. He says this one's a little bit harder. Uh-oh. Uh oh. How are multiplication and addition different? How are they different? Have a conversation with your shoulder partner about how multiplication and addition are different. Conversation, please. Class, class. Yes, yes. How are multiplication and addition different? Because my mom and dad says that I need to know. Dun, 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 dun. Multiplication and addition are different because addition is put in together, but multiplication is repeatedly put in together. Awesome job. Give them a 10 finger woo. woo! So addition is when we can put different groups of things or different groups of people together, but when we do multiplication, those groups have to be put together over and over and over again. It is the factors that tell us how many times to put them together. Kim, can you be smarty this time, since Tayanche took your turn that last time, and tell us your conversation about how these are different. How are multiplication Different. Dun, 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 dun. Multiplication and addition are different because multiplication is more efficient than adding. Excellent job. Give them a 10 finger work. <laughs> Woo! Class, class. Yeah, yeah. Hands and eyes. Hands and eyes. I want you to think in your brain. Think down deep in your brains. Dig in there. Really reach in there. I want you to think about a multiplication problem and how the multiplication problem would look different as a repeated addition problem. Reagan, give me an example of a multiplication problem and then tell me how it would look as repeated addition. Tell the class class. Class class. Yes, yes. Here's the word. Here's the Boy. Four. Times. Times. Three. Three. Equals. Equals. Sixteen. Sixteen. Tell her it's cool. It's cool. Take your problem four times three. That's good. Tell me how that would look as repeated addition. Four times three is repeated addition. Three. Plus three. Plus three, plus three. Excellent job. Give her a 10 finger woo. Woo! Another example of a multiplication problem that you can put into repeated addition. Luke. Uh, class, class. Yes, yes. 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 Mirror to words. Mirror, Mirror to words. Two. Two. Times. 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 Seven. Seven. 
How does it look as repeated addition? It looks like repeating addition. Excellent job. Give him a 10 finger move. Oh, class. Oh, yes. Drum roll, please. <laughs> Hands and eyes. Hands and eyes. We are now ready for the Mega Genius Challenge. Oh, I don't know. I'm not sure you're ready for this. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. You really think you can handle this question? Yes. So this morning in reading and writing, we talked about main ideas and details. And today in math, we talked about factors that build up to products. Your question today, Biffy asks, is how are multiplication and main idea and details alike? Mirrors and words. Mirrors and words. The question is how. The question is how. Our multiplication. Our multiplication. And main idea and details. And main idea and details. Alike. Alike. Turn to your shoulder partner and tell them ways you think multiplication and main idea and details are alike. Teach. Okay. lost our enthusiasm there at the end. Mighty groan. Ah! So who has some ideas about how multiplication and main ideas and details are alike? May. Multiplication and main idea and, and, main idea and details are alike because um, multiplication has factors which lead up to the product and main idea is like the product, and the details are like the factors. That is an excellent job. Give her a 20 finger woo. Woo! Woo! I need all my friends gesturing with us. Mighty great. Ah! Let's try it again. 20 finger woo for me. Woo! Woo! That was better. Yeah. That was a 40. Oh, yeah! Who else has some ideas about how multiplication can be connected to main ideas and details? Zach. Multiplication and main multiplication and main i and main ideas and details are alike because multi multiplication main idea details help you find the main idea and the and the factors can help you find the product. Excellent job! 20 finger woo for Zach! Woo! Woo! Okay. Hands and eyes. Hands and eyes! If you think the answer to the question is yes, we do. Yes! Coach! And if you think the answer is no, we do. No way! Okay, here is your first question. Multiplication is putting together equal groups. Yes! yes coach! The numbers we multiply together are called sums. No way! Very good. Um, Jacob, what are the numbers called that we multiply together? Tell me in a complete sentence. The numbers we, the numbers we multiply, multiply is called factors. Very good. Time to go. Okay, next question. The answer to a multiplication problem is called a product. Yes, coach! Very good. 
Number four, we can use repeated addition to solve multiplication. Yes! Very good. Last question. The time sign means add. No way! Gair, what does the time sign mean? The time sign means multiplication. Very good. Give him a five finger. Uh-huh. Uh-huh.